how to remove the steering wheel on a BMW 316i compact or other compacts I believe should be the same. I'm not a mechanic, I'm just some poor sap who've had to do the job. Um, in the other YouTube videos they tell you, which is very important, to disconnect your battery. Leave your battery off or disconnected for oh, at least half an hour. Mine's been off about a week because I've had other work to do on the car. Uh, like I said, I'm not a mechanic. I'm making this up as a go. But this is what I've just found out. Now, I looked all over YouTube and I could not see how to do this anywhere. Everywhere else, there's two holes around about there on the steering wheel. And you put something in there and you give it a waggle and it releases the mechanism inside to get the airbag off. When to do it on this car? No. On this, on, you won't be able to see properly, but she says where my finger is. <laughs> you can't even see it. I can't. This is difficult. Yeah, where my finger is there, there is a torque bolt. So you will need those. Most um, socket sets will have those in it okay uh, most screwdriver sets have them now you will need a short extender on that side because you won't have the clearance and you'll need the longer one on that and then all i did she says is i popped that on it i undone it and then did it by hand and then basically that popped that off those are the screws that are coming off right so that's what releases them they don't actually come out but that's what they are right and then all you do is disconnect those and then obviously because of your battery's off this doesn't blow up in your face and kill you great guns and then i believe that's a 16 or whatever and you take it off from there and i've got to work out how to uh why my horn and airbag sensor is not working and i have absolutely no idea at all so wish me luck but for all you lot with compact now you know how to get your ear off